Hi, I'm Andrea of BioGray Answer, and today we are going to prepare a chicory casserole, a delicious side dish with goat cheese, prosciutto ham, and some orange. And we're going to bake and grill this casserole in the oven. And then we're going to serve this delicious dish. We're going to start by washing and cooking the chicory. But before I go to do that, I'm going to cut the chicory in half and remove the hard core. For it's very bitter and it's not quite that delicious. Preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. Take a pan and fill it with water and bring to the boil. Have four chicory heads and remove the hard core. Cook the chicory in the boiling water for 8 minutes and drain them in a colander. Grate the orange and set the rind aside. Then have the orange and juice each half. Put one slice of prosciutto in front of you and put half a chicory head on top. Roll the prosciutto around the chicory and repeat that for all chicory heads. Put them all in the casserole dish. Put the orange juice in the casserole and top the chicory with the orange root. Then crumble 4 ounces of goat cheese on the veggies, that's about 100 grams and drizzle a tablespoon of honey on top. Sprinkle with fresh thyme and spread the walnuts on the chicory. And now this chicory casserole is ready to go into the oven. We will bake it 50 minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius and then broil it for another 5 minutes. Put a casserole dish into the oven and bake for 15 minutes. Then turn on the grill and bake for 5 minutes more. I've taken this chicory casserole from the oven and you see it's quite delicious. The goat cheese has melted and together with the honey it's caramelized. And the prosciutto and the walnuts are tender and crispy. And it's a really delicious dish. This recipe is enough for four persons, but if you're in need for more, you can go to my website. It's got a great feature, which will do the calculations for you. And we're going to enjoy this chicory casserole. Thank you for watching this video. The full recipe can be found in the description below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment on this video. At my blog and at my channel, you can find over 100 delicious recipes that are all easy to prepare. And with one thing in mind, it's a good taste. Bye!